Welcome to the Grow Family Network. Today we're just gonna do a quick mulberry cutting update. If you remember last bee flying around, if you remember not last spring, but spring just passed, we actually were able to get some mulberry cuttings. Uh, we did plant about 20 cuttings, and this is the reason why you want to take as many cuttings as you can and plant them, wait for them to root. I'm probably a little too late because I already dug up one and, and I'll show you how that looks. So I dug this one up, I put a little bamboo stick on it and I'm gonna put it in here. Hopefully it makes it because this is a new transplant. Now that I've transplanted again, it's, it's going into another kind of transplant. And so it's gonna suffer from a little shock because I've disturbed the roots. Hopefully I didn't wait too long to dig them up. So I put this over here. And I'll show you the reason why you wanna take uh, not just two or three or four cuttings. Take as many as you can. And it's because I pulled up, I pulled up about, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven cuttings that didn't do anything. So that's one of the reasons why take as many cuttings as you can. Probably use this for barbecue. I want to show you these roots. When, when I pulled up that first one, the roots are like yellow. So I wanted to show y'all that. And hopefully somebody that, that actually went out and got some cuttings and was waiting on this video, like, man, I wonder what to do next, what to do next, when to take them up. Well, it's going into fall now, going into winter. So I know mostly all of my uh, mulberries lose their leaves during the winter. So it's going to go dormant anyway. I would guess I probably should wait to do it, but I'm going to do it anyway because a tree this young, I'm going to be taking it inside during the coldest, coldest parts of the year and the nights anyway. So I'm not going to really worry about that. So let's get in. I'm going to go to one of these smaller ones here. It's hard for you to see it, but once I get it out, I'll bring it closer to the camera for you to see it. All right, let that dad get in. Let that again. Let that All right. So this is actually, you can see these yellow, yellow. Wait, baby. Go ahead, take it. Take it my daughter trying to help but you can see these yellow real real deep yellow roots not used to seeing no not over there so what we're gonna do is I got this pot I'm gonna put some rocks in the bottom of it for drainage and then I'm gonna plant it so give me one sec so I'm gonna put some rocks right where these holes are and you can see them and that's going to be good enough for my drainage. I don't really just go crazy with the rocks at the bottom, but I do put them wherever I see a hole at. Now I'm going to pre-fill with some soil that I have, the bottom part. I'm going to put this here so you can see me do it. It's just a real sterile mix. I'm probably gonna start next year, I'm gonna start investing in like some perlite and vermiculite to kind of loosen my soil. But I'm not as good on watering, so this soil won't really get that wet. It'll have time to dry out. So I'm gonna take this with my roots, my root ball, some extra saw that has been around. I'm gonna set all of that in here. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. All right. Now I'm going to try to get this. I 
this they call this native soil since it's been here so I'm gonna put some of that in with it go ahead and cover it up up to where it was the same line it was covered up to and that's another mulberry tree that one is that one looks nice I like the way it's coming out uh, so that's about it I got about let's see one two like I got about I got three more to do so out of 20 or so cuttings I've got five trees hopefully at least two of these trees make it through the transplant process and that way I'll have two free trees when I didn't have anything and next spring if you hang around with us for a little while next spring is when I'll find somewhere to put it in the ground so thank you for watching the Grow Family Network quick video mulberry cuttings update. And as always, grow, grow, grow. <laughs> Good job. Peace.